I played an XXL Steve's French Minecraft event, but I was one of the only people who weren't French. So I'm gonna be trying a different style of video for this because the VC was pretty boring and there was like basically nothing going on. So there isn't really many times where I talk. So I'm just gonna be commentating over to make the video more interesting. So this is basically the first phase of the event where we basically had to collect resources. So we had an hour to collect as many resources as possible. So we could then use those resources to build in the next phase. So basically this was for mining gold and diamonds and iron and we just had to do all the basic things to start off in Minecraft like cutting trees. Then Cornet decided to join our VC. Hello. Hello. Hi. Okay, so here's the, the briefing. This is the mining stage. Okay. You have one hour uh, to take as much resources as you can. You can use the, the slash slash chest command to open the the backpack which is shared between the whole team what oh uh, my god what did mean yeah uh... so pvp is enabled uh oh, but okay. keep adventure is is also so don't worry you'll keep your stuff i'm i'm basically clueless i have no idea how any of the mods work so i'm just gonna it's i well goffin will explain uh okay. well he left she's back okay um goffin is the the expert here can you hear me Okay, okay, good. So can can you like explain how the mod works? Cause I, I don't understand any of it. Well, I'm gonna try and murder someone. I just, I just killed, I just killed someone on blue team, sorry. Attacking the other team probably wasn't the best idea considering I'm definitely not the best at PvP. Let's go! <laughs> we're, just, we're just killing each other now. Mine ores to make stuff for everyone, so just any, any ore is fine. Yes, let's go, one more dead. <laughs> After getting some basic tools, I decided to go mining for iron and gold. A few minutes of searching for iron later, I managed to find a massive cave which turned out to have loads of diamonds in it, which you'll see later in the video. This cave also had loads of lava, and it went down all the way to deep slate, so it was really OP. The cave also had a lot of iron, so I was able to craft an iron pickaxe so I could mine diamonds. Okay, iron pickaxe. Let's go, I can mine gold now. Yeah, I know, gold spawns so much, but there's no, uh, there's no iron at all. I've just found diamonds though, so that's cool. Oh, I found more diamonds. I'm rich now. I found an amethyst geode and decided to collect an amethyst shard so I could make the most important item in the game later. No way, I, keep, I found so many diamonds. I have 11. Okay, well, watch this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get cover me with diamonds. <laughs> Cornet saw that both teams had diamonds, so he decided to challenge us to go to the nether. I still had a lot of spare iron because there was a lot in the cave, so I decided to craft some iron armor for myself so I'd be safer going down deeper into the cave. After crafting the iron armor, I went straight down to find a lava pool so that I could make a nether portal. Oh yes, I found a lava pool. Unfortunately, I completely forgot that you needed water to make obsidian, and I didn't bring a water bucket, so I had to go back up again. I decided to stay down for a little bit longer so I could mine some more diamonds, and it was definitely worth it. I got a lot of diamonds. I found a mine shaft, so I decided to stay down for a little bit longer, but this was my mistake. No, they got to the nether before us. I found a spot. Hello. Hi, XXL Steve. Hi, Robot Dinosaur 1 for I'm free. almost full diamond. Well, you know, one guy has like a lot. You kind of need to get more diamonds. You you guys really need diamonds. Here, there, there are some. I have loads of diamonds. I just got, I just got a blood apple. Okay, wait. Come here, come here. Do you see me? Don't tell me you just missed the beast. I didn't even go there. 
I think you guys could like mine some obsidian and stuff to protect the the chest. Yeah, I'm trying to get obsidian, but I, there's no iron anywhere. Oh yeah. So I'm trying to get a bucket. Cornet then did a vote for night vision. Everyone said yes. I love democracy. Yay! I can see now. Since blue team had now gone to the nether, there was no prize to go into the nether anymore, so I focused on getting as many diamonds as possible. And I found a lot. Meanwhile, Cornet was talking about the mod to us, and I'm gonna be honest, I had no idea what he was talking about. I think you could try to get 12 to get more bellows. It depends if, if you're gonna try to do a lot of airships or not. I don't know what I'm gonna try to do, just just tell Gofin that, because I have no idea. <laughs> Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. If you have questions, just tell me in the chat. Oh, yeah, by the way, if anyone wants diamond armor, when I come to the surface, I can give you some diamonds, because I have over a stack now. Oh, TBG is here. In the whole event, TBG was the only other person who wasn't French. I was pretty happy that there was another English speaker. At this point I had so many diamonds that I was just running past them because I couldn't be bothered to mine them. I finally managed to make a bucket so I decided I would go to the nether so I could try and find blue team's portal and maybe do a little bit of trolling. Okay, I'm getting, I'm getting obsidian. But before I did that, I decided to get full diamond since I had enough diamonds to spare anyway. Here's a montage of me mining obsidian and while this is playing, I'd just like to remind everyone to subscribe right now and also join my Discord server, link in the description. Uh, yeah, enjoy myself mining obsidian, I guess. Um, I got enough obsidian, so now it was time to go to the nether and try and find the blue team's portal. Ooh, I found someone else's portal. I think I found the blue team's portal. I'm not really sure why I decided to go back into the overworld, but I did, and I almost died to lava. I might die. Okay, I'm fine. I'm fine. Okay, I'm gonna go troll the blue team. I'm gonna go into their portal. Well, they've got like this whole obsidian thing. They've been mining a lot of obsidian. I then proceeded to mine their entire nether portal and steal all their obsidian. Oh no, I found someone. I just killed the blue team. <laughs> oh wow, blue team's in a massive cave. With less than 10 minutes left, I didn't really need to be underground anymore, so I decided to go up and gather some final resources for the building phase. However, as soon as I got back up, the blue team found me and started killing me. Is that it all? Yes, let's go! Let's go on a murder spree. I'm dead, I'm dead. I've vanished. I also didn't realise that you were supposed to right click to put up your shield on Java, so I died. Yeah, I'm dead. My shield, they crit, they critted my shield. Now I was away from blue team, I decided to actually do what I was supposed to do and get some final resources for the building phase. Bows, I can try. I can- I actually have- I have strings so I can get- I can, uh, I can craft some bows. Except the blue team found me again. Oh god, I'm being attacked. My shield is broken, my- oh- oh wait, I don't know how to put up shield. Okay, that's- that- that works. Oh, you have a shield? Yeah, I, I, I play Bedrock, so I didn't know how to put it up on Java. Eventually, I did manage to craft some bows without the blue team attacking me. To be honest, it was deserved though, since I killed them. I'm gonna follow you, okay? Okay, I, I don't know where I'm going now. Yeah, no problem. With less than three minutes left, I managed to find a mineshaft, but I almost died to zombies. This was embarrassing.
Quick surge and uh, looting too. Oh, okay. And three uh, iron. Remember when I said earlier about making the most important item in the game? Well, this is where it comes in. Wait, I need to make a, I need to make a spyglass. I need to make a spyglass. <laughs> okay. This is gonna be funny. I don't know why. It'll <laughs> be funny there. Oh my god! Uh, Twenty seconds. I. I need wood. I only had 30 seconds left, so I went full speedrunner mode and mined the wood as fast as I possibly could. Uh, I'm just gonna make a spy cast. It's the last time. Please, please. <laughs> 10 second. 8, 7, 6, 5, 4. No, no, three. no, please, 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 please. <laughs> Okay, I have, I have two copper, I have two copper. Wait, I'm gonna, wait, the timer hasn't changed, I need to make one now. Yes! I have a spyglass. I can look at you with a spyglass now. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. Oh, okay. Let's go. Everyone look at my spyglass. <laughs> We're now in the second phase of the event where each team was given a chest to put their valuable stuff in. We then had an hour to defend it in any way we wanted, and also build airships, which we'll see later in the video. Okay, where do we put the double chest? Where would be a good um, place for it? Is that I'm gonna look around, see if there's anywhere else where we could like hide it. Oh, there's like an underwater thing here. There's an underwater cave here. Oh. That could be an interesting place to put it. Yeah, like all the way down. I mean, you you can defend it after, by the way, so... Yeah. Um... So, like, is this good here? Yeah. Yes. Is that is this good? This place? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. I'm quite safe. Okay. Uh, I will add the. No. No, please don't drown. <laughs> <laughs> because I didn't set the spawn point, okay. so it's gonna break everything. Okay. 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 Starting. All right, TBG get. Um, I will give you. I will, I will give you the ship helms and balloons in, in just a moment. Please okay. uh, be glad. Be patient. <laughs> Why? Stuck. Why is he stuck? Okay, so I'm gonna put obsidian around it first. So you can put obsidian and all that stuff. I'm gonna drown. Yeah. I'm gonna drown. Come, come, speed, speed. No. Oh, no. <laughs> oh wait, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. What is here? Since I was the one who collected the obsidian, my job was to defend the chest. But I soon realized that building underwater is really, really painful. This took way too long. The combination of mining slowly and almost drowning all the time made it really hard to do this. It took me like 30 minutes, and I also ran out of obsidian like halfway through, so I had to go down to a cave to get some more. Okay. Um, Come on, can you give me more obsidian, please? I've run yes. out. Yes. More obsidian? Yes. No, <laughs> that's not a decoration block. <laughs> I'm like too short. No. I need two Absolutely more. Please. Not. Yeah, there's a lot under you. You still have time to mine, actually. Um. Okay, I'm gonna give you the other ship helms and stuff in your chest. So you're you're having one ship and try. Why? We, what, how do they get onto our side? I don't know. I'm setting the spawn point, but it's not working. Oh. Nice. Yeah, I don't know what's. Oh. <laughs> okay. Okay. I'm going. Guy. I'm gonna ask them. I then had the absolutely amazing idea of surrounding the entire chest in water, so it would be harder for the blue team to get in. Now oh. you just protect. I mean, you like you build a base. We can build some some airships. It would be really cool if you did. Please make what is, some. What is an airship? <laughs> like something with the mud. Eureka. Okay. Like uh, add physical stuff. I I gave you two ship hel helms in the chest and one ship engine and uh, twenty balloons. Please give me two obsidian right now. There is lava under you. 
It's, oh wait, you can get some very easily. Just mine down. Where? If you go like uh, deep enough, minus fifty. Are Sorry? all French people oh. just like gods oh, of you? Do they just it? understand everything about it? No, no, they don't. <laughs> None of them know the mods. Before long, our team ran into a problem. We didn't collect enough food, so our food supplies were quickly running out. I'm, I'm just gonna steal this, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Griffin, but I, I have no food. You know what I do have? I can make a jukebox, and I, ha and I have a music disc as well. <laughs> <laughs> you, got, you got music to listen to now. No! Oh, free music disc, let's go. I'm gonna dig straight down. Because I ran out of obsidian, I had to dig all the way down to deep slate and find a lava pool so I could get some more obsidian. I then once again persuaded Cornet to give me night vision. Yay. I eventually found a lava pool so I mined some more obsidian. And then I jumped in a lava pool because it was the best way to get back up. Okay, I'm back. Since I now had more than enough obsidian to defend the chest, I started placing water around the chest, as I planned to do earlier. This would basically make it so that it would be slower to mine the obsidian when the blue team broke in. I definitely spent way too long doing this though, and in the end, it definitely wasn't very good anyway. And also, I still kept drowning while trying to build it. I'm done with the water. I've just uh, I've put water everywhere. We got night vision again. Yay! No. <laughs> oh, now it's just now your night vision's gone. Hello. Hello. Hello, XXL Steve. Hello, Robot Dinosaur. Do you like for... my glass? Wow, the most useless block. I mean, item. I can, I can spy on the other team. Yeah, sure. Oh yeah, so keep inventory is gonna be disabled, of course. Oh no, oh no. Oh. <laughs> it's PvP, so... I just got jump scared by a creeper. Yeah, you could have killed it and gotten... Gun I don't know what was that, it was in my inventory. You will have two respawns. So I would say, like, maybe make a small base when you respawn to get some stuff, yeah. like backup. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, actually, I think you're like both uh, um, about the same amount in terms of obsidian. Yeah. But you could have like definitely done it better. <laughs> like maybe flood a bit more. Put yeah. like buttons on the side, stuff like that. You know. While I was mining obsidian, my team was building a castle and also building airships. So I decided to try and figure out how the airship worked. Work? No. No, without shifting, without shifting. Oh, oh. Oh yeah, it does. Okay, great. <laughs> I'm just flying now. I'm gonna go spy on the other team. No, no, no you're not allowed to. You can't go on. Well, uh, I'm doing it. About them. Well, in that case, I'm putting bar barrier blocks. Okay. And I'm destroying your airship, no, so, no, 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 yeah. No. Oh, 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 no. Look. How do you go down? No. <laughs> that's how... <laughs> that's how you go down. Oh, no. Oh, oh! Where am I oh, going? No. Where am I going? What? <laughs> oh, no, oh, no, bro. I don't know what, what I just what did. What happened? I don't how know did what it I just go did. go there? The airship's gone. I'm sorry. We now had less than five minutes until the final battle, so I tried to make the defense a bit better by adding some more water. But I got lazy, so I decided to start playing music again.
15 seconds. No, the music disc. No. So the preparation was over and it was now time for the final fight. I wanted to try and find the other team's chest so I could steal their items. So I basically just took one of the airships. I don't know what I'm doing. I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> and while the blue team was literally breaking into our base, I was trying to figure out how to go down on an airship. My team was already dying and we were basically already losing and I still couldn't find their chest. I have no idea where the chest is. So it turns out we might have forgotten to put anything on our chest, which was pretty embarrassing. Okay, so uh, you didn't put anything in your chest. I didn't know we were supposed to put stuff in our chest. So either you put it now or you just have nothing and you will have no points. And while we were on pause because our team forgot to put stuff in our chest, one of the members of the blue team found me. Yeah, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm so dead. TVG in the rescue. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I need food, I need food. Someone please give me food. I really need food. Wow, only two people left in your team. I have literally no food at all. Luckily for me, the god apple I found in the dungeon earlier helped me regain some hunger. Uh oh. <laughs> oh god, I'm, I'm getting 2v1 now. Uh, there is kill, some. I wanna kill oh, Blue oh, Guy. Yeah, so cool. Oh, you can't sprint? Oh, you can't pick. Oh, Gofin is here too. Oh no, no, no. Uh oh, no, no. you're the no, only I'm one. I'm getting here. 3v1. I'm just getting 3v1. Run. Just run now. There's literally nothing I can do. And with all three members of the blue team chasing me, I had barely any hope left. I'm gonna die. I'm actually gonna die. Okay, go for it. Well, you, you still have one life, by the way. I don't have- I won't have stuff! Yeah, that's the, the pro. Oh, okay. Okay. Well done. Well, they, they still can steal your stuff. But just when I thought I was safe, I heard mining. Even though I had no stuff, I decided to make a run for the chest one last time, but unfortunately the blue team found me. Oh, they found me, they found me. No, I'm, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. I'm just gonna try and stay alive for as long as possible. No, no! So even though we lost in the end, the event was still really fun. Go subscribe to XXL Steve, he hosted the event. I'll put this channel up here now, and thanks for watching, bye.